here to give you a very quick video on how you can make your own HDTV antenna and save yourself some bucks at the store. First off, if you're not familiar with it, it was uh, years ago we actually switched to digital transmissions instead of the analog broadcast TV that you grew up with or your parents grew up with. Now it's all digital. It's a great picture. If you've seen DirecTV or some of the others, you're looking at the exact same digital quality kind of picture available from the HDTV. I personally tried out several different antennas, the old rabbit ears, some of the newer box kind of designs, and honestly, uh, I felt like I threw my money out the window, and I still had a few of the stations that I was supposed to get in my area, but they weren't coming in. So, searching around the internet, I found this great place, uh, I think it was called hubpages.com, that had an article by a man named of Dave Muse, if I pronounce that right. But Dave designed a dual bow tie antenna and another type of antenna, which I'll show you the first one. This is not the bow tie antenna, but ta-da, there it is, spit and glue, people. Spit and glue, aluminum foil, and a uh, couple bolts to hold my ballon on. But that's all it takes to make this antenna, and I'll try to uh, arrange it around there. As you can see, I have the fancy cardboard with the uh, lovely uh, writing still on the bottom of the box, but... You know, mine are as basic as they get. If you search around the internet, you'll see some others that are made to look a lot nicer than what I did, but I never thought the things were going to work to start with, so I didn't want to spend a whole lot of time prettying up something that wasn't going to work. But, ta-da, shock me, they did work and work well. Now, two designs. This is one design. Um, this one, according to Dave, is great if you live in a city and you're having signals coming to you from all directions all around you. Um, you're probably better off to go with this design. If you don't live in the city, and I'll be right back after I grab the other one here. Like myself, you're living more where everything is coming from a certain direction or away from you. Then this is what Dave calls the dual bow tie. Of course, obvious enough, what's the bow tie? The dual bow tie um, HDTV antenna. And just like the other, it is spit and glue, aluminum foil, and uh, a little bit of tape. And the actual part, the one part you do have to buy is this. And I hope you can see this is a part of it in the back. And then you can maybe see where it connects in the front. That's called a ballon, which is a conjunction of balanced and unbalanced. Makes the word ballon. But that's what you need to match the 75 ohms that you need to go into your uh, TV to provide the right ohmage for the signal. So... Those you can pick up from way too expensive to uh, a couple bucks. I think I paid three dollars for this one. So I do have three dollars in my design here. But um, Dave has put up great instructions. I you know, personally never thought I could make something like that out of cardboard. If you look, it's a fairly uh, complex looking design. But with a little glue, a little cardboard, a little razor knife, uh, he'll show you how to shape this up. You basically print off the patterns, cut out your pieces, glue them all together. I'll put that back up there. Cut out your pieces, glue them all together, and you're good to go. And shockingly, from after spending money on these things, the only ones that truly work and give me the signals to all the channels that are available in my area are the ones from Dave. So thank you Dave for the great designs and the whole point of this is to steer people over to Dave's site. So if you'll look in the uh, right up below for the video or if you're coming from the uh, actual article written up about this then uh, I'll have the link there. But go to Dave's site if you need an HDTV antenna. It doesn't get any better than this cost wise and quality wise. Um, there are a lot of uh, comments are that, well, I spent $70 on one that'll do what this will do. So if you want to save yourself 70 bucks and you got an afternoon to burn putting this thing together, uh, you'll have a good HDTV. All right, follow. Go see Dave. Thank you.